Hello, hello, hello. This is Gresh from Blue 16 Web Services and CB Nation. And I'm going to share with you exactly how you embed your podcast from Spotify for Podcasters into your website. And if you didn't know, um, Spotify actually bought Anchor. And with that being said, it started out as Anchor. Um, and then it eventually became Spotify for Podcasters as they're doing a big, huge push uh, for podcasting in so many different ways. Um, so this video is going to pretty much show you a little bit on how you set that up. We actually had a video that we created way back in the day, about five years ago, where we showed you exactly how to embed uh, your Anchor podcast into a WordPress website. And we're going to do the exact same thing, but with the updated now Spotify for podcasters. So simply what you're going to do is make sure um, that you have the website that you want to put the site into. And I'm going to show you on a WordPress website. Uh, but of course, the embed code can pretty much be placed into any type of uh, website that takes HTML code. And then you're going to find your uh, Spotify for podcasters um, log in and just log into the site, you'll see that there's an episodes tab and you're just going to look for any episodes that might be published. Um, from there, you're just going to click on the episode and then you're simply going to find these this copy embed code. And from there, what you're going to be able to do is go back to the site that you want to upload into. So I'm going to upload this into a post. I'm going to call the post the exact same thing that we called it through Spotify, now Spotify for podcasters, but it's now Anchor. And if you're using a WordPress site, typically if you're on the visual tab, you're going to have to, to select the text tab so you can embed the actual HTML code. And you're just going to copy and paste that in. You can also right click and click and select paste and paste that in that way as well. Um, and I'm just going to select the title that I had for the episode. Um, you can select any specific um, categories that you want. It's always good to use any specific tags as well too. Um, and then I'm also going to take this image and I'm just going to save that image. And we're going to drop that image directly into here just so we have that so it has a featured image because I'm creating this as a blog post. And it might take a little bit of time and you're gonna set your featured image and then that's pretty much it. You're going to hit publish or if you want to, you can just preview it first just to make sure it looks exactly how you want it to look. Um, and there you go. And then you have the episode right there. So instead, I'm just going to publish it and depending on how you have your um, your blogs or your posts, the way that that setup is going to determine exactly how it looks. But the important part is you're going to be able to to check and, and see um, the link in the code. So you play that, and that'll play your episode. But and there, if you heard, there's a there's some information. Now, it's always a good practice to not just put the the podcast there. It's always a good practice to also have some show notes. So I'm going to copy these show notes and we're going to go back to edit this post. And we'll take this and I'm going to switch back to the visual tab and I'm gonna enter this content. You wanna be very, very careful often. It might be better to add the HTML code in after you, you put in the text that you want. And the reason I say that is because sometimes when you copy text in, um, especially if you don't space enough or you space too much, there might be HTML code and unless you know the coding, then it might make it a little bit more difficult. So that's just gonna be an extra space that's there. I'm going to remove some of those spaces, go back to here, and this is how it's going to show up. Also, whenever you're copying um, any type of links from here, you just want to double check to make sure that it does capture the, the correct link that you want. And that's basically it. So I'm just going to publish this. And that 
is basically how you're going to update this. So there we go, we have the, the text in here. Now, I'm gonna show you two other things that you can do to really, I think, take this to an entirely different level. Um, I'm gonna go back to my Spotify for podcasters and I'm gonna look at this. And what I actually wanna do is go back to the episode page and I want to download this episode And this is a pretty long podcast, so it might take a little bit of time. I'm actually going to go to a, a CEO hack called Otter. And you can take this and you can just go to import file, browse, and you're going to drop and drag this directly there. And what this is going to do is transcribe your podcast. Um, it's not always 100% foolproof, but again, when you're trying to create show notes and you try to make sure that it's SEO friendly, uh, you're going to be able to uh, basically put this into um, your site. And the best practice is definitely to make sure that you um, copy and paste this in, but you also could um, embed you know, this specifically from Otter in, but it's always the best practice to take this content once it's created and uh, make sure that you um, embed it from there. So that's really, you know, one cool thing that you can do uh, with this episode just to, to lengthen and make sure that all the content and all the things that you said in the episode are going to be good. And then the other big thing that you could do is you could check out um, CEO Hacks. And from there, we're going to go to podcast resources and another really good podcast resource that you want to check out. It's going to be Headliner. So we're going to go to Headliner. And you want to make sure that you sign in to Headliner 2. And this also does uh, transcription as well, too. Uh, but we want to take this. We want to select the audio file, we want to upload, and we want to drop this into here. And we're going to be able to look at the different ways that we can uh, create this. And you can put any specific information that you want to put there. Um, of course, I'm going to go back to editing this text. And you might decide that you also want to um, replace this with another image. So we're going to do the CEO podcast. Um, maybe potentially you want to change the color as well too. And maybe match that. And let's go to create. And it's going to create, it's going to take a little bit of time, but it's going to create from there. So I'll come back and show you exactly how this looks for both of these things. And I'll show you exactly how to embed them um, onto your a site. All right. So it took a little bit of time, but once this loads, um, I'm going to show you exactly what I would do to improve the overall copy. So you can basically just download and export um, this from Otter. Um, you can choose which format. So I'm going to speak, I'm going to pick this specific uh, format and it's going to export it as a TXT file. 
And I'm just going to take that txt file and we'll just copy and paste it in. And we'll go over to our post. And we'll find a section that we can add a transcript. I'm going to style it a little bit different um, just to kind of break it up. But let's do transcript. And we're going to copy and paste this in. And that's just the otter. You might want to include otter. You might not want to include otter. But I'm going to go ahead and remove the otter part at the beginning. Um, and I'm going to add. this to stand out, make it a header two, and I'll probably just add this in. And transcribed by Otter. Our CEO hack, Otter. Yeah. And I'll probably put a link um, just to include that. And then what I'm going to do to kind of get everything off, I'm going to use this opportunity to share from headliner and I go from headliner again I'm gonna find something that I could use and embed And then from there, probably just either share this someplace else, or I'll probably just download the video and maybe upload it. So this is going to be a pretty large file. So I want to go back to um, just from best practices, you might want to upload this in a third party software. Um, so you might want to put it and embed it over at YouTube or something along those lines. But just for the sake of this, I'm just going to show you if you were to have, let's just say, a shorter version of the file, you could take it and upload it. It's probably going to be a little too big uh, for this. And depending on how you have the post, you can embed it right there. So then that'll show the post right there. But again, you just want to pay attention to the best practices. Um, so I'm going to update this. And we'll view the post. And just like that, you have your image, you have your audiogram, and then you have your transcription. So that just kind of enhances the overall um, optimization of the post. So of course, we just started out with just uh, making sure that you're able to embed that um, actual um, that actual um, podcast into the site. And then from there, you start to improve the overall optimization of the site. So that kind of showed you a little bit on how you're going to embed the podcast from Spotify for podcasters into the site and also how to improve the overall optimization of it and those uh, different CEO hacks that you can use including Otter and Headliner just to make sure that you're creating a better overall experience for the people that are visiting your site. So if you have any questions you of course reach out to us at Blue 16 Web Services and we can of course help you out and do all this for you so you don't have to worry about it but of course if you want to go and DIY it you have the steps uh, in order for you to do that. So uh, we appreciate it and hope you have a phenomenal rest of the day.